In the beginning, there were computers, but they were enormous, cantankerous creatures operated by scientists wearing pants in universities. Then they were smaller, but still generally useless until the day they learned to talk to each other. The internet. All the information and pornography you could want. But sadly, we got tired of learning about worldly facts and what people looked like naked. And once again, computers were the modern man's paperweight. Until... Funny or Die. Yes, Funny or Die, now considered to be the most successful business in the world by four out of five dentists. This Hollywood powerhouse came from humble beginnings with a radical idea. What if people enjoyed watching funny videos on the internet? The trillion dollar question! People did enjoy watching funny videos on the internet. Funny or Die's founding fathers called upon their famous friends and soon the whole world was laughing. Before too long, Funny or Die expanded into all areas of entertainment. There was everything from big screen independent film to small screen premium cable. There were podcasts, apps, pictures, words, and blogs. Oh my. So, how did it all happen and what does the future hold for Funny or Die? Why don't you just sit down and shut up for the next hour? That's what you're here to find out. And by the way, follow up Funny or Die on Twitter.